Are you a day trader looking to make quick profits in a short amount of time? If so, you need to know about the powerful scalping trading strategy that can help you explode your small account. In this video, we reveal the secrets behind the best scalping strategy for 15 minute and 5 minute time frames, as well as the top indicators to use for scalping. Whether you're trading Bitcoin, crypto, Forex, or stocks, this scalping trading strategy is perfect for day traders who want to make quick profits in a short amount of time. But before that, I want to introduce you to our backtesting service as it makes it very easy and saves you time when backtesting your strategy. Thousands of traders are using Trader Edge to get an edge on their competition. It also has a lot of features that would definitely take you one step ahead of your trading career, just like the position calculator that serves as a great tool for risk management. Are you not sure how to backtest? No worries, you will also get a full step-by-step -step backtesting plan which has a $100 value. Not sure how to build a profitable trading strategy? No worries, you will also get a full course on how to build a profitable mechanical trading strategy which has a $270 value. And if you sign up right now, they'll even throw in 4 pre-made high quality strategies that have a $100 value. That's $470 worth of bonuses all for free. But only if you sign up right now. Trader Edge has a 7 day free trial so there's absolutely no risk. Click the link in the description below. To make the most out of this scalping trading strategy, you need to use the right indicators. One of the most important indicators is the divergence for many indicators V4 by Lonesome the Blue. This tool checks every single candle for different divergences on various indicators such as MACD, RSI, and Stochastic. Whenever the indicator spots a bullish or bearish divergence, a label is printed on the chart, indicating a strong signal. The more indicators it found divergences on, the stronger the signal. To avoid some false signals, let's first adjust the settings for these indicators. We would only make use of the volume weighted MACD, as it gives more accurate signals that fit our scalping setup. Some of these signals can be quite accurate, but I do not recommend using this tool on its own. However, to avoid false signals, it's best to combine this tool with the pivot point super trend and the auto trend line indicators. The pivot point super trend is used to identify the general trend of the market and to give accurate buy and sell signals. Once you've applied the pivot point super trend made by Lonesome the Blue to the chart, we want to change the appearance of the indicator so that it's easy to catch longer trends. And to do that, you go to settings input and follow this exact preset that was created. And as you can see, the pivot point super trend gives more accurate buy sell signals than previous settings. Now add the last indicator to the chart to better eliminate false signals from the market. Add the auto trend line. This one right here by Doji Emoji. The auto trend line indicator automatically gives trend line placement on the chart, as well as identifying the points of higher lows and lower highs. So we don't have to go through the pain of identifying these trend lines ourselves. For this scalping strategy, we only consider the higher low trend line when the market is on a bearish trend, as well as the lower high trend line when the market is on a bullish trend. By using these three indicators together, you can create a profitable scalping trading strategy that can help you make quick profits. So when is the best time to buy using this scalping trading strategy? The best time to buy is when the market identifies its general trend as bullish, indicated by the pivot point super trend. When the price action changes direction to bullish and sits above the pivot super trend, we go long only when we identify the conditions for long entry. And for a valid condition to be considered, follow these simple steps. 1. The best way to re-enter the bullish run is to wait for a purple label on a bullish trend and expect the price to experience some retracement. 
And the best way to re-enter the bullish run is as follows. When we get our volume weighted MACD purple label, we identify the lower highs of our trend line. 2. This next step is easy as we pull up our tools section. Inside the option for trend line, we select the regression trend. 3. Simply draw your regression trend to match exactly with the auto lower high trend line. 4. Notice we have our regression channel. Now for the final step, we either wait for the price to break above the regression trend or as on some occasion, we open trade if price is already sitting above the regression trend. Overall, if we are on a bullish trend and a bearish divergence occurs, if the price is above or breaks above the regression trend, this is a strong signal that the price will continue to go up. By adding the pivot point super trend and auto trend line to the chart while maintaining the conditions for a buy, we also eliminated a lot of potential fake signals. Here are a couple more examples for successful long trades. So we are on a bullish super trend, and we see that the divergence indicator gave us a purple label for bullish retracement. Also, notice that while we got the divergence label, we also had our lower high trend line at this point. Placing the regression trend would give us this trend channel. We then tend to open trade if price action breaks above this trend line. Set your stop loss at the lows of the last higher low trend line point as indicated by the HL and target at least two times the risk. So we can notice that price has broke above the regression trend line, but since we got a new signal at the next candlestick, we would be closing this trade for a minimal loss to hunt for new entry. This prevents us from overtrading. To properly manage risk, we exit the trade if price action closes below our middle regression trend line. Also, if our take profit or stop loss levels are yet to be hit, and we get a new signal, we exit our trade and hunt for a new position. As this gives us the signal that the market is likely to retrace or reverse. So now, we have another long trade and this one is much better. We see our conditions are met as price action is above the regression trend line. We would therefore enter trades at this point. Set your stop loss and take profit levels while also on the lookout to properly manage risk. And we see it successfully won. By applying this regression trend to the chart, we avoid taking trades that turn out to be market reversal. For short trades, wait for the pivot point super trend change to red, then also wait on your next bearish retracement. Lastly, carefully match your trend lines with the higher low trend line. It's easy. Just select your regression tool and match the higher low lines exactly as you see them on the chart. Extend your trend lines with trading view trend line tools. Await the breakout below our regression trend line. Stop loss, take profit levels, and risk management are the same as our previous entry. Here's another great example for a short trade. We see the pivot point super trend is on a bearish move, and the indicator found a bullish volume weighted MACD. We enter the market once conditions are fulfilled.
So yeah, traders, give this indicator a try, and I'm sure it's gonna make you a lot of money. In conclusion, this scalping trading strategy is perfect for day traders who want to make quick profits in a short amount of time. By using the right indicators and waiting for the right conditions, you can explode your small account in Forex, crypto, and stocks. However, it's important to note that this strategy is for educational and entertainment purposes only and is not financial advice. Thanks for watching this video and see you in the next one.